Um, I'm Allie Hartman. I'm from Winnipeg, Manitoba, and this is the Verna J. Kirkness Science and Engineering program. What program are you involved in? I am involved in biosystems engineering. Why are you involved in biosystems engineering? What's, what's really interesting about that? Um, well, actually, when I was introduced to like the opportunity of this program, I had recently been to the U of M, like the campus, for a night of excellence or something, and it was it was just like showing all of the programs, and I saw the engineering one and thought it was a little interesting. I really like math. Uh, it, that's where I excel, I guess. So, thought I'd give it a try. Okay. How did you get involved? With the how did you find out about the program, and how did you get involved with the program? Um, a teacher at my school told me about the program. Thought I'd be a good candidate. Candidate. She was actually a science teacher I had. I guess she recognized that I was pretty good in science. So. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, tell me about like your experience so far this week. What did you, What did you do? Like, what have you been doing this week? And then. Just get, tell me how you felt about everything. Your oh, okay. This week, um, the the person I was working with, my mentor and my lab partner, we've been working on, um, or we've been working with our mentor on a project that he's doing on a lake. It's about uh, the sediment at the bottom of the lake. Pretty much, there's just a lot of phosphorus in the lake, and he was just showing us like different ways to like detect the phosphorus and how much there was. Um, yeah, we got to play with some mud. <laughs> it was pretty fun. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Um, what was your? Tell me about what you thought about university prior to coming, and then tell me when you arrived. What were you thinking? Like, how did? You know, what was the expectations? And tell me about the experience you had when you first walked in. When I first walked into uni, well, I guess what I thought of university is just what I've been thinking of school. Like, it was pretty organized and like. Uh, it was a place and a time and stuff, and it was very like, I guess, I don't, I don't know, structured with like teachers on your back, but I kind of noticed that the students here are all sort of like, they're on their own schedule and they, they're they responsible for getting to class on their own and like, it's, they have like classes in the evening, which is really weird to me. Um, yeah, just kind of surprised by all like, they're like, it's very individual and yeah, everyone gets to do their own thing. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, I guess, tell me where you're, where are you from? Like, where is your family from? Um, my family from... The city or...? Oh, uh, I've lived in the city my whole life. And um, my family, I guess my mom, she grew up in Duck Bay, Manitoba. Uh, yeah. And that's, okay. I guess, where my family is from. Okay. <laughs> um, what would you say to, like, some, some young people coming up, they're watching this video, and they're, like, thinking about come to university, they're thinking about even this program or sciences or program you're involved in. What would you tell them? Because I'm sure you, you felt that maybe there was a hesitation here, but maybe there wasn't. Mm -hmm. What would you tell those young people if they're thinking about this? Um, just do it, <laughs> I guess. Uh, it's just a really good experience. Like even if you don't find that you don't like the science and like the engineering part, uh, it's actually really like good to be like on the university and see how the life is. because. That's the part that I liked most, like being in the lab was kind of, I don't know, I guess, uh, I guess not like some people's like ideal environment, just like in a lab all day, but I really liked like living on campus and like in the dorms, they were really cool and like just, yeah, that part, that aspect of it is really cool, so I think anyone would like it. <laughs> right on. Um, I think that's everything. So we're going to